My name is Keely Selvage with Keely Skin Solutions. I've been a clinical esthetician for over half a decade, and I'm going to talk to you about how to make body butter. Now, body butter is great. Um, it's almost like a body lotion, but without the water. So it's much more emollient. It's going to hydrate you even more. <clears throat> so I'm going to show you how easy it is, but when you're doing this at home, you probably want to use more. So you're going to start with 10 ounces of shea butter. Now you can get shea butter um, at any health food store. This is actually seven ounces and it's affordable. You just take that and we're gonna use the double boiler method. So you wanna start with a large cooking pan, put a little bit of water in it, and then get a heat safe dish to put inside it. Okay, so I've already done that and I've heated up my shea butter so it's nice and soft and really easy to mix. So we're gonna go from there and we're gonna put a little bit <clears throat> of a fixed or carrier oil in it. Now I love almond oil. Almond oil is very hydrating and it's very soothing for the skin. And I'm just gonna add a little bit, but for your recipe at home, you wanna use about six ounces. Okay, so I'm gonna add some of that. And then you wanna add two teaspoons of cornstarch. Cornstarch is optional, you don't have to have it. But what it's gonna do is uh, make it so it's not so greasy when you put it on the skin. Which if greasy is okay with you, well then you don't have to put the cornstarch in it. And then you wanna put your fragrance in it. You can put any fragrance oil in that is safe for the skin or you can just use um, essential oils, which is what I like. This is a peppermint oil. Peppermint is gonna be um, awakening or stimulating. Lavender is great too. It's very calming and it's actually hydrating as well for the skin. So in this one, I'm just gonna put a couple drops, but when you're making yours at home, you can use up to one ounce, but a half an ounce should be fine. So I'm just gonna stir that up. A nice little tip too, is you can actually make edible body butters. You can get um, edible essential oils. There's flavored flaxseed oils, all of those things. You can make yourself a nice little tasty body butter. So you're just gonna stir it up. You wanna store it in a nice um, tight container and refrigerate it for as long as possible. My name is Keely Selvage with Keely Skin Solutions and that is how you make your at-home body butter.